the book of law read to the people. Josiah was a young and righteous king of Judah, who wanted to restore the worship of the true God in his land. He had ordered the repair of the temple, which had been neglected and defiled by his predecessors. During the renovation, the high priest Hilkiah found a scroll in the temple, which contained the book of the law that God had given to Moses. He gave it to the king's secretary, Chophan, who read it to Josiah. When Josiah heard the words of the law, he was shocked and grieved. He realized how far his people had strayed from God's commands, and how much wrath they had provoked. He tore his clothes, and sent Hilkiah, Shophan, and other officials to inquire of the Lord, what they should do. They went to a prophetess named Huldah, who told them that God was indeed angry with Judah, and that he would bring disaster upon them. But she also said that God would spare Josiah, because he had humbled himself and sought the Lord. Josiah decided to act on the word of the Lord, and to make a covenant with him. He gathered all the people of Judah and Jerusalem, from the greatest to the least, and brought them to the temple. He stood on a platform, and read aloud the book of the law, in the hearing of all the people. He did not omit a single word, but read everything that was written in the scroll. The people listened attentively, and were moved by the words of the law. They heard the blessings and the curses, the promises and the warnings, the statutes and the judgments, that God had given to his people. They heard the history of their ancestors, how God had delivered them from Egypt, and brought them to the promised land. They heard the voice of God, speaking to them through the law. Josiah then made a solemn declaration, and said, This day I make a covenant before the Lord, to walk after him, and to keep his commandments, and his testimonies, and his statutes, with all my heart, and with all my soul, to perform the words of this covenant that are written in this book. And he asked the people to join him in this covenant, and to pledge their loyalty to the Lord. The people agreed, and said, Amen, Amen. Josiah then proceeded to carry out a thorough reformation in the land. He removed all the idols, and the altars, and the high places, that the people had worshipped. He destroyed the priests, and the prophets of Baal, and Asherah, and other false gods. He celebrated the Passover, as it had not been celebrated since the days of the judges. He restored the worship of the Lord, according to the law of Moses. He did what was right in the sight of the Lord, and he did not turn aside to the right or to the left. The book of the law read to the people was a turning point in the history of Judah. It marked a revival of faith, and a renewal of the covenant. It showed the power of God's word, and the grace of God's mercy. It inspired the people to follow the Lord, and to obey his will. It was a day of joy, and of hope, for Josiah, and for all the people of Judah.